Hi everyone, today we will solve this lead code medium problem searching a 2D matrix. Let's first understand the problem statement. So we have given a matrix uh, which is sorted. Uh, it's sorted row wise also and it's sorted column wise also. Like these numbers are in increasing order 10, 11, 12, 13 and similarly each and every column is also sorted 12, 16, 30, 39, right? Now we have to find one uh, element uh, which is like let's call it target right so let's say you have to find 15 one brute force solution is you can iterate over whole matrix compare each and every element with the target if you if it matches with the target you can return true else you can return false but that's not optimal solution because so now uh, one more solution is because this matrix is sorted right we can take advantage of that fact right let's say if we start from the top right corner right so we can if if target if element is greater we can compare it with the target 13 with 15 right so because it's sorted column wise right so it, that means 13 is less than 15 we have to move down right if third if let's say we are searching for 10 right so 10 is less than 13 so in that case we'll have to move left so we'll move in two directions only either down or left okay so let's run through this example target is 15 so 15 is definitely greater than 13 we'll move down again 15 is less than 17 we'll move left right compare 16 and 15 15 is less right so we compared 15 with 15 it's a match so we can return okay you can return true so let's take one more example where we have to find a uh, search for 32 so we compared 13 with 32 um, it's greater we'll move down we compared 32 with the 17 so we'll move down compared 31 with the 32 again it's greater so we are moving down because it's sorted column wise right so there is no point of moving in this side because this element is already the max element of that row right so now we compared 32 with the 31 uh, we uh, compared 50 with the 32 so definitely 32 is less than right we'll move left side compared 32 and 39 again left side again left side and we compare 32 with the 32 and its match will return true in that case okay so uh, let's right now write the code for the same right so we'll start from the top we'll start from the first row and the last column right int column So last column will be matrix 0 dot length minus 1, right? Now, so this condition will fill it till later, right? Now what we have to do is we have to compare this guy with the target and if it is greater, right, target is greater, then we will move down, else we'll move left side. Okay, so matrix row column we come if it's less than target right if if this element is less than target then we'll have to move down which means um, row plus plus right because because we are moving to the next row okay else if Uh, matrix row column if it is greater than target right if it is greater than target that means like this example 32 right we were moving left side which which means like we were we were on same row but we were decrementing columns right column minus minus right if none of this this is true then we'll simply uh, return true from here right else uh, this is the else will return false okay so now think about this condition we are incrementing we are starting from the row 0 and we are incrementing right so every time so it should not go beyond the matrix length right and column we are decrementing every time and we are starting from the last column so we should add this condition column greater than equals to 0.
let's try to run this code now so it worked right let's uh, try to find something like let's say we'll search for 23 okay work let's try to submit okay now uh, because here you were like kind of so so complexity of this is o m of uh, o m plus n right so one more optimal solution is let let me undo this so we can what we can do is we can consider this whole matrix because because whenever it comes to be sorted array right we think about binary search so let's see if we can apply that here in this case also uh, let's consider this whole matrix as a flattened array flattened array i mean like 12 13 14 15 16 17 27 29 30 and let's say 50 right so what we do in binary search is we find the mid right like this is our start and this is our end right we find the mid right mid is end plus start by 2 right so let's say here our uh, total number of elements are 15 right right so mid will be 15 by 2 7 right so 17 will be our mid like 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 right 17 will be our mid so now uh, what we'll do is we'll compare target with mid right if it is greater if it is less then we'll change our end right we'll say this is our end and if it is greater we will move our start so it's the same plain binary search logic which we can apply here but uh, the one uh, thing is which we'll have to think about is how you will find the row and column index right so now 17 is our mid right so this is at seventh index right now how you will figure out that this is a first row and third column right zero one two three third column to find this index what you can do is you can just divide mid by number of columns so number of columns here mid is your seven right and number of columns are uh, four right and row will be one right and to find the columns what you can do is mid modulus number of columns seven modulus four which will be three right so you will you can easily figure out the index of this guy right row and column index once you figure out the row and column index the normal binary search logic you can apply here right so now uh, let's write the code for the same so see uh, what you need now is right you have to find the start and end in the binary search right so start will be zero and your end will be um so first let's see the number of let's call it number of columns will be matrix zero dot length right so sorry and number of rows will be matrix dot length right okay so now end will be end will be if this is a four by four matrix right so number of rows into number of columns minus one right so let me copy paste these variables <coughs> so sorry number of rows into column minus one and what we do in binary searches we just run the while loop till our start doesn't meet our end right start is less than end now what we have to do is we have to find the median right uh, sorry mid mid will be 
you can write you can also write start plus and minus start by 2 to void our flow but let's say I write this start plus and divide by 2 okay so now we have to find the row index right so row index what we discussed was it will be mid divide by number of columns right mid divide by number of columns and our column will be mid modulus number of columns okay so now we have row and column right what we have to do is we just have to compare this we have to pick this element from the matrix and compare it with target and accordingly we can decide whether we have to go right or we have to go left right so what we'll do is if matrix row column is greater than target right if it is greater than target let's say we are searching for 13 and this is greater than target 13 i mean target is less than mid right then we'll move this side if your target is less than your element you will adjust your end right so your end will be your mid minus one right else if matrix row column is your less than target then you will adjust your start mid plus one okay and now let's see everything matched up i mean like if it is not greater not less then definitely we found our element right okay so let's see if we are doing any mistake uh illegal okay double equals okay so let's try to search something which is not there in the array okay let's submit it now yeah it worked okay thanks for watching if you like this video give thumbs up or subscribe my channel to see more such videos thank you